Leafs have their first preseason game a week from Saturday when they host the Montreal Canadiens. But Toronto Maple Leaf star Mitch Marner is having one of the biggest assists of his career and actually his life away from the ice. Obviously last year we missed this event and uh, like I said, it's great to be back in person with everyone. It's great to be back on the ice with uh, all the children. After having to put last year's Marner All-Star Invitational on hold, Leafs forward Mitch Marner was back in action on Friday with his foundation, the Marner Assist Fund, raising money for several grassroots foundations that help provide sustainable change for children and youth. And hopefully, you know, people are inspired and, and, and everybody pays it forward. We just went a couple weeks ago or maybe a month ago and we're packing some lunches up for Second Harvest. And, and I said to them, anytime you need us, just give us a call. We're absolutely available. Within the last year, Marner's Foundation has donated thousands of dollars to students to help overcome barriers that can stand in their way of education, money to the Sick Kids Foundation, helped families facing food insecurities. The list goes on and on. His work away from the ice is admired by his teammates and other professional hockey players. What Mitchie's doing for kids and uh, providing, um, you know, an impact on their, on their lives, it's, it's huge. And, um, you know, us being able to play the game we love, it's really cool to see the platform Mitchie has and is using to help kids. He's obviously a big part of our team too, a good friend of all of ours, so we want to come out and support him. And any chance you, anytime you get a chance to do something like this, it's, it's, it's a great opportunity. On top of Mitch just being an incredible person, he does a lot for the community and I think it's great to pay tribute to that and be here for him and for the kids today as well. I've actually never been to this rink before, but a local rink, which is really cool, and a lot of people that are interested in it. So, you know, it's fun to be able to do something with the community. Part of the Marner All-Star Invitational saw the pros teach some of the youngest fans skills on ice. What are your coaching skills like? Uh, that remains to be seen, you know. <laughs> I don't know how it's going to go, but I'm going to give my best. And, uh, you know, I think maybe just try to instill confidence. That'll be my strategy. <laughs> Not very good. I think just try to stick to playing. <laughs> Coaching skills not so good, uh, but uh, no, it's nice to see the kids and just kind of chat with them. I just want to thank everyone for donating. It's obviously uh, very excited to be back in person with everyone, so uh, we look forward to next year. Since it launched just a few years ago, the Marner Assist Foundation has raised over $600,000. Reporting from Vaughn for City News, I'm Lindsay Dyer.